was only active in YouTube. I mean, I actively sharing only my travel videos in YouTube last year, 2018, right? Or 2017. Because uh, those years passed back 2011, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. I don't really have interest in YouTube. And then it's, it's just one time my friend told me why don't you share your travel experience experience in YouTube and I didn't think about it and I guess she's right so here I am you have to plan ahead so plan ahead that's buy a plane ticket that is on sales this, this is the reason why you have to plan ahead because most of the tickets on sales like the extremely extremely cheap plane tickets like they are 70% off 80% off and most of these tickets they the travel dates will be after one year after six months after two years it will be nice if you will travel with a friend with a family or with a group because if you will do this you will be able to save into your accommodation and food because then if you will travel with a group the expenses will be divided travel DIY like do it yourself however if you're first time traveler I guess I need to do a different video for this so yeah for do it DIY do it yourself do not rent a car or do not rent a tour guide you must have a plan book or journal so you will you you have your tracks so you have your activities on the list so that you will not miss your flight your flight you will not miss you will not miss your tour you will not miss any activities so that it will not cost you anymore because I've already missed my flights and it cost me really really bad when you miss your flight and you will try to buy new flight it's extremely expensive it will cost your just one flight will cost your entire entire vacation so it's it, 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 it is really important that you have journal so you can keep your tracks you can keep your your schedules and things like that do not eat in restaurants try local foods I mean try try street foods mostly most countries that I've been to they have a very clean very tasty and really really cheap foods for example Vietnam Thailand Cambodia of course avoid staying in a luxury hotel stay in an apartment transient hostel or motel or Airbnb they are really really cheap and it will not cost you a lot of money and it is better if you share it with your friends or with the group so stay in do not stay in a luxury hotel always bring your rep your tumblers water tumblers because buying waters like for example in 7-eleven they cost a lot of money so if you bring your refillable tumblers you can refill in your hotel in your transient in your hostel or you can refill everywhere wherever you go where there's a, a water fountain or water fill, refilling station that will save you a lot of money too avoid getting into trouble so it will not cost you money or else your life so avoid going into dangerous place avoid 
parting and avoid getting drunk so you can drink just don't get drunk because when you're drunk you don't know what's gonna happen is an ex so if you if you will avoid if you will avoid trouble it will save you money and save your life so that's how I travel on a budget I'm sharing it based on my experience it's not based on people's experience or I'm not just guessing I have been traveling a lot I've been into 12 countries in Asia and I'm sharing that based on my experience because all the time I am traveling on a budget I've never travel on uh, first class so to anyone who wants to travel on a budget you don't have I also I always say that you don't have to be rich to travel you don't have to be rich to reach your dream your dream destination all you have to do is uh, be on a budget and what you have to do is be flexible and be wise so that's it for this video and thank you again for watching if you have questions regarding to traveling regarding to this topic please leave a description down below and if you have questions about countries in Asia I'll try to help especially if all, I've already been into this country and I'll try to help you bye thank you for watching